Hello again Chaparral fans, want to do an interior walkthrough on this 2009 Chaparral 280 Signature. See you've got the, uh, as I showed in the exterior walk around, your uh, sea deck flooring on the um, swim deck back here. You've got some rear, uh, rear facing upgraded JL audio speakers jamming out the back. And uh, you'll see the little door here, transom door. Let you come on through. You'll see the sea deck flooring continues in throughout the cockpit. Here's your uh, battery switches right here. Um, got a little step here. And then a built-in cooler down there. It's nice to keep it out of the way, make room for your guests. Wet bar here with a, a sink and your uh, upgraded JL Audio continuing throughout the cockpit. See that fixed radar arch, really nice and classy with lighting up there. Got your uh, nice, really nice quality um, Bimini in excellent condition. Great coverage from the sun there. Uh, ample seating back here in the stern. Probably enough seating for, you know, five, six adults. However many kids you want to throw back here. Uh, this seat here does uh, fold down and stow away if you want to create more room back here for anything. So you've got your cockpit table there. That also pulls out if you want to create additional room. JL Audio, cup holders, you know. Really nice. The upholstery is in excellent condition throughout. Really almost flawless. I did see one little prick right here. Just probably got punctured by something, but not from not from where. Just a little tear right there. You'll see, um, got your uh, spot here for your passengers. You can sit at least a couple adults or a few kids there. Again, that upholstery in excellent condition. Um, then uh, got your uh, JL sub built in down there, up in the house. Here at the captain's helm, you've got a double wide seat with flip up and down bolsters, really nice. I like to stand while I drive, so that adds a lot of value for me. See um, that sea deck even on the, the foot pads down here at the captain's helm. Uh, really nice gauges. You know, got your Garmin unit right there at, at an aftermarket. Really nice addition. Um, you know, throttles for your twin engines there. You'll see none of this is faded from the sun. This boat's been very well taken care of. See your yacht certification there. You can throw as many people on here as your little heart desires. No capacity limit. Um, go on up through here to the, the bow. Just show you that really quick. You know, really nice, clean bow. Plenty area for the ladies to lay out, catch some rays, throw some towels down here. There's no built-in cushions. You could have some made aftermarket if you wanted, but uh, just throw some towels down there. It's plenty comfortable. Got your... Uh, Stowage for your fenders right there. Um, you know, window through to the cabin. That also opens, creating some airflow in the cabin there. Got your anchor locker and your windless foot controls there. Nice galvanized uh, Delta anchor. And got your electric windless in here, making life really easy. Got your uh, road down there with some chain and rope. Really nice setup. Very clean up here not oxidized or faded or anything really good shape up here on the bimini you've got i'm not sure what that track vision is to be honest but you got your garmin there and uh yeah it's really nice let's go back through do a little uh walk through the cabin here good uh, nice door here open that up you'll see there's uh wood flooring throughout that's really nice upgrade carpet just is not conducive to to having a clean cabin so that's really nice it really helps it keep it nice and clean in here um got your aft cabin back in here really nice entry i've seen some of these have a really low entry this isn't too bad doesn't feel claustrophobic got a double size bed in here oh i was looking for those filler cushions right there there they are you've got a, a dvd player and a tv back there good area for the kids to hang out got nice lighting in there really like these uh these uh, vinyl surfaces as well in here, more contemporary than uh, some of the cloth ones you'll see. Nice little uh, little cedar lined closet right here. You've got your JL amp and uh, fire extinguisher, some other miscellaneous things. But, uh, really nice cabinetry as well. I like that color. Looks contemporary. Um, got your uh, uh, AC panel in here. Um, your head unit for your stereo. Generator controls. This does have a uh, built-in five kilowatt uh, Kohler generator. I think it's got a little over 300 hours. I've got a picture of that as well. But uh, anyways, really nice, nicely appointed cabin here. 
You see that uh, nice lighting built in throughout. Um, nice booth here to, you know, enjoy a little uh, dinner or lunch or whatever. Um, this does, uh, this, there's a shorter pole that puts that table down further. There's a, fill, uh, there's a filler cushion that fills that area in. Nice little sleeping area for kids. I used to have a 280 Sun Dancer, and that's where my girls always wanted to take naps. It's a really nice area there. Um, see a nicely appointed little kitchenette here. Got your uh, refrigerator. Works nicely. All the cabinetry is in excellent condition. Um, got your uh, your sink right here. It's nice, hard, uh, classy surfaces here. Little stove, microwave, TV with a uh, DVD player right there. Vent for the air conditioning. This uh, this boat does have air conditioning built in. Keeps it nice and cool in here for uh, overnight stays or day out on the water to escape the heat. Got your... Uh, your V-berth bed up here, that's plenty big enough. I'm 5'11", uh, 205. It's easy for me to crawl up there and lay down. Plenty of room for a couple of adults up there. But uh, anyways, if you want me to put that in perspective, go ahead and crawl up here. And, you know, I'm laying all the way out. Plenty of room for me to lay out here. I have my wife right beside me who's a little shorter if I wanted to. You know, stay the night. Put the kids back there in the aft cabin or, or right here. But... Anyways, plenty of room for a family to sleep on here. Um, go on through here, show you the head. You've got your uh, vacuum flush toilet there, nice and clean. So there's a, uh, the sink there. That, uh, that handle does pull out, creating a shower. And there's a drain down here in the floor, so everything drains out. You could stand up and shower in here, whatever you'd like. Nice lighting, even a fan in there. But, uh, really nicely appointed head there. And again, I really like this nice cabinetry. It's all in, or this, these um, finishes here, all in excellent condition throughout the cabin. And uh, really nice and contemporary. Really pretty roomy in here for a 28-foot cabin cruiser. Love to get you aboard and let you see for yourself. Adios.